Hello video editors. Welcome to Solid Tutorials. In this video I am going to show you 3 creative masking effects tricks in Filmora 11. These 3 creative masking effects tricks are so cool, yet easy to do that anyone can do. I made this video with a lot of hard work. Hope you all like it a lot. So let's move on to the video. Open your Filmora video editor. Oh one. The first effect trick I show you is behind object. As you can see in this video I move the ship behind the person. Thanks to this trick you can put any object behind in any video. I drag and drop the video onto the timeline. You need a video of someone standing something like this. Then you need an object in the green screen video. I drag and drop the video into the track above the timeline. If you want this green screen ship video, its free download link is in the description. I remove the green screen background of this video using the chroma key tool. So you can see that we have removed the green background of this video. After doing this, we now need to apply animation to this object. In which we will move the ship from left side to right side through animation. For that, double click on this video. Go to the animation tab and click on it. And then click on customize section. Place the playhead at the start of the video. In the first keyframe I scale the plane down. In the same keyframe I also add a little rotation and change its position to disappear on the left side of the screen. Move the playhead to the end of the video for the next keyframe. And in this keyframe I change the position from left side to right side. And in the same keyframe I move the position of the plane up a little to the right side of the screen. So it will create an animation something like this. Drag and drop the same video into the track above the timeline. Then go to effects tab and click on it. Here we have to search for an effect. The name of the effect is human segmentation. If we apply this effect to the video of the track above, we will have something like this background removal. To apply this effect, drag and drop it onto the video of the track above. So after doing this, our first masking effect trick is successfully finished. O2. Oh, in the creative masking effect trick I'm going to show you at number 2, I'm going to show you a very genius way of color correction. As you can see the difference and comparison between these two videos. And in this masking trick I'm going to show you this creativity. I, try to pay for you. I have a video in media for this masking trick. I drag and drop the video onto the timeline. I have this video original something like this. Again I drag and drop the video into the other track of the timeline. So you can see that I dropped the same video in both tracks. Next, hide the bottom track. Double click on the video of the track above and then click on the masking section. Here select the circle mask shape inside the mask. Set the size of the mask according to the size of the face. Adjust the blur strength within the mask settings. So you can see that I set the blur strength to about 15.79. After doing this, we have to move the mask over the face frame by frame using keyframes animation. Like tracking that shape through the animation. How I adjust the position and size etc. of this shape through keyframe animation. After tracking the shape through the keyframe animation, double click the same video. Go to color tab and click on it. Within color you can do color correction according to your video. Here within this, I unfold the tone tab. And from here I adjust its brightness. Oh, 
After doing this, show the video of the track below. So you can see guys how weird color correction we did in this video. Maybe this color correction masking effect trick will be very helpful for you. Got drunk off your life, and I lost myself again. You hit it just like a drug. This time I won't you. Oh three. The creative masking effect trick I'm going to show you at number three is to remove the unwanted object. As you can see in this video, I have a girl in this video. And in the second video, you can see that I have removed it as unwanted object. In this creative masking effect trick I'm going to show you. So for that I have a video on medium. Again I drag and drop the same video into the top track. Double click on the video of the track above and click on the mask section. From here select a mask shape according to your object. I select the circle shape. Before adjusting it, hide the bottom track. Adjust the blur strength first among the mask settings. I set the blur strength to about 7.40. Now we have to position the mask shape to the area where we want the color to match while keeping the area above the object. That is, the example is something like if we copy the color and paste it on top of the object. After doing this, you can now show the track below. Now double click on the video of the track above. Go to transform tab and unfold it. From here change the position of the video area and place it on top of the object. If it needs to be increased in size, increase it. If the object is not covering this part of the mask video, copy the video. And paste it in a separate track above. and also change its position and place it on the other side of the object I place it on the shadow of this object so through this creative masking effect trick you can remove unwanted object etc in any video hope these three creative masking effects tricks will be very useful for you guys please like this video if possible share with your friends if you are new to the channel you can subscribe to the channel guys if you haven't seen this video of 50 Filmora secrets tips and tricks yet then you haven't seen anything about Filmora. Now click on the link above and watch the video. See you again with a new awesome video. Goodbye.